TK Tower videos brings you Digimon 2016. I can't remember what kind of voice I was using for all these guys because I streamed it a while ago. Oh, there's an Impmon I can talk to right there. Impmon's fucking rad. Anyways, I have mail first, so let's check that. Oh, it's from Kamimon. I wrote everything you need to know about fishing here so you won't forget. First, find a fishing area for a circle. In front of the fishing area, choose your bait. Once you chose your bait, start fishing. Watch the boat carefully. If it moves, press the circle button really and reel it in. The bait does message. You can catch certain kinds of fish more easily with certain kinds of baits. So try lots of types. Also, you can sell any fish you don't need. Depending on the type of fish, you might get a good price. Oh, I got fucking meat and digi mushrooms and smiling apples. And holy shit. Just fucking pile it on. Awesome stuff from Chuma. How's the buoyancy program working out? Feels great to be able to walk on water, huh? Well, I just wrote you because I was curious. See you. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for turning me into Jesus, Chuma. Let's talk to this fucking Impmon now, man. Oh, that Impmon's way bigger than Impmon should be. Ew, so nasty and gross. I couldn't make myself touch it. It's impossible. What's impossible? The guys at the city hospital asked me to look for medical ingredients here. They told me to come here to find ingredients. I figured they'd be nasty and gross, but now that I'm here, it's way more disgusting than I thought. I'm trying to gather something. It's called a sea anemone. Yeah, they're gross. Isn't it? That's why I thought I'd be great. I figured I'd bring that and the guys at the hospital would freak out. But the problem is I'm scared to get close to it. Uh, I don't know what to do. I'll get it for you. No way, you'd help me? You're the first human I've ever talked to. Even though you're human, you're a pretty sensible guy. Plus, you're helping me out. Somewhere around here is a huge sea and enemy. Please find it for me. I'll wait here. I'm counting on you. Yeah, the, uh... The game is not out in English. I have an English patch. That's cool. There's a lot of fucking fish. Oh, there's a fishing spot here. Let's, let's just do one a little bit of fishing. Door from this weakness makes this an apple smile to be given a win in a bad mood. Maybe I should save that from an actual Digimon. I'll use a Digi Anchovy since I got some now. That's important to know. Yeah, let's try going this way. Oh, that's a fucking Mega Seedramon right there. I'm pretty sure Mega Seedramon's also. Oh, and there's the two people. Okay, so this is clearly the end of this area already. You, you did something to the memorial, Stella. My mission is to protect it. I'll put a stop to any evil deeds. Oh, it's useless to resist. Well, I think we better put a stop to this. You want to protect the memorial, Stella, no matter what, right? Let there be no misunderstanding. We have the same objective. Wow, fucking wrecked. Please understand that the memorial Stella stopped, but it's not our fault. But if you stand in my way, I have no choice but to do this. Yeah, you, you don't want to get too close to a fucking Mega Seed anymore, are you fucking nuts? Ah! So, so had some energy. I was careless. Murray, are you okay? 
Damn. Hey you, aptitude person, help us. It has protected the, the memorial stella for many years. That is the purpose of its life. If you're careless for a moment, you'll end up dead. Watch out. Oh yeah, fucking two on one. Oh, I got a heal right away. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be the fucking special. Boom! Fucking nailed it. Wow, that scratched me. <laughs> I started this. I started this battle weakened. So now, what's her face is just throwing health items at me. Maybe this was a smart idea. What's happening to Greymon? What are you doing? Get in there and fight, man. I think I think that Anju Woman is going to be doing way more damage. Yeah, she does like 400. I barely do two. Her regular attack is about as strong as my Nova Blast. Oh, and I take huge damage. Oh, thanks for healing me. I think I better just have, uh, no, I'll just use one right now. Oh boy, I used one as well. Oh no, a special on me? Oh, I gotta stop it! Yeah, defense up. I still took an unreasonable amount of damage despite defending it. I might get another special though, so I'm happy with it. Yeah, there's there's no way in hell I could win this battle without the help of Anju Omon. Oh crap! We oh, almost got him though. And by we, I mean her. I'm not doing anything. Maybe that's the game's like in Digimon World One. If you went to a place that was too strong for you, you'd get your ass kicked like brutally maybe this is the game's way of saying like hey we remember the game was hard here's help rely on them and i totally did so that's okay i got an autopilot too that's nice fucking stat ups Gwah, beaten by humans how can this be all right see you later seems like you're retreated but tk why did you help me being helped by someone gives me a strange feeling I think she's like me now. Yeah, I did the thing. Well, let's check the content of that garbage data. You're the only one who can do this, TK. Yeah, helped is right. I didn't help. I helped by doing that one, like, special attack. That was it. That one special attack was as strong as her regular. I didn't do a goddamn thing. On Jewelmon's ultimate level. I'm only, like, a fresh champion. That's bullshit. Bit by bit, my eyes open. Bit by bit, begin to understand. I want to know more about this world. This message. Has it begun to understand words? If that's the case, the growth rate of this thing is even faster than I expected. Anyway, we recovered this place's garbage data. It doesn't seem like this life form will appear here. So the next one should be the, I mean, the ancient bone swamp. Party bot or foe, you're distracting me with your bobs. Can't you see there's already a distracting amount on my screen right now? We should be going back to the city. We need to get some rest. Well then, let's meet up in the city. Let's go on to one more. You know what, you get some praise for being- Oh, you got injured? Oh, Alright. I happen to have a band-aid with me. Oh, I've got three. Here you go. Sore. Kore. Sore. In World 1, it wasn't very long before you could get someone else working at the meat farm that would eventually start giving you, like, giant meat. I hope I can unlock that soon. Oh, that Mega Cedarmon is just chilling. Oh, I'm going to grab that Digimon from first. I hope I don't have to fight him, though. That would be bad, like, if I fought him by myself. Please just talk. Phew, what are you doing here? 
Our fight really brought me back to my senses, so I guess it's a good thing I lost. I wanted to go back to the city, but I didn't have the strength. You need something? Yes, I need something to eat. Could you bring me some fish? You got it. Well, that's great. Thank you, young one. Please, before my strength gives out, please bring me some fish. I got fish. Oh, this is fish, isn't it? I'll eat it right now. Will you give me a seed from mine? Oh, that's just asking. I don't need to do a voice. Black Digi Trove. That's like my biggest one! Oh, fine. Munch, munch. Phew. I feel a little better. I'm still pretty beat. Please, can you bring me some more? Oh, you're busting my balls, man. Yeah, you can have my fucking Digi Devil Carp, too. Oh, both of them? How much fish does he want? Oh, I'm keeping my fucking anchovies. Oh, I guess you can have the eel. Just a little more. Well, this is a fishing spot right here, so he's fucking lucky. I'll use some anchovies to catch up some big ones. Maybe I should use that eel as bait. Maybe I could have gotten something even bigger. That's enough for him. Oh, finally. Alright, I'll teach you a technique of mine. Oh, I got a waterfall. If you use this, you'll be able to use my technique. I'm sure it'll be of use to you in battle. See you then. I suppose we'll meet in the city. Oh, yeah. Fucking got another boy from my city. Oh, there's a marine Anjumon over there. Let's talk to the fucking marine Anjumon. What are you saying? Oh jeez, none of these is really it. What are you doing? I'm looking for cute things. There are starfish flying around here. I think I'm on the right track, but I haven't found the right one yet. Could you help me look? If you find a cute one, then tell me. You have to tell me. Cute starfish. This one's cute. Maybe it needs to be extra cute. Oh, that's uh, I want to say Airdromon. If I remember. Anyways, I'm not feeling too confident about this area right now because uh. I think it's a bit too strong for me. Oh, there's that imp on over there again. Oh, you brought me a starfish. Let me see. Mm, that one's not so great. It's just not cute enough. I hate to ask, but could you get me another? Oh, now you're busting my balls. fucking dump all my starfish at her. That one looks neat. Is that the one I want? Pull on it. I'll use fire breath. Alright. 
Well, I guess, yeah, I guess we'll just sleep now. Mata hasta ne. Sure, let's save. So I got another starfish, but it was the one that you want. Are you sick? Why are you sick? Oh shit, man. We better head straight home then. Oh, there's that one. Wait, is that a f an imp one to fight? Cause it looks like it wants- it looks like it's in, it doesn't have a thing above its head. Yeah, I think that imp one fights. I don't want to fight. Uh, maybe it isn't a fight though. Yeah, it is. Oh, oh good. Oh, I'm draining the digital mode. I think I'm gonna get my ass kicked No, those attacks don't fucking hit shit. Oh, I got my ass kicked. I could have sworn all I had to do was throw a healing item at him. But I guess that is not the case. And then I died. Oh, TK, your partner clasped. Your partner has lost one of its precious life points. Whenever your partner is in a pinch, please support with recovery items. When victory is not likely, train and re-challenge the enemy. Cherish your partner. Please be careful on your journey. I tried, though. I tried my damnedest. Anyways, let's go get me. I guess that was a pretty fast way to get back to the city. Oh, Chumon, you're here. Oh, there's that black Agumon I didn't get a chance to talk to last time. Only Digimon who live in the water can cross the sea. Those who don't will need something special to get across. Rumor has it someone's got a program that'll let, that will lets you walk, lets you to walk on water. Oh, that was rough. I had a hard time getting through that one. Go ahead and sleep in the middle of this guy's house. He loves it. Yeah, let's have another save. Yeah, and we're gonna rest for a little bit too. Oh yeah, I forgot I named it Ugyumon. And I believe another day passed, so let's get some more fucking meat. Oh, it's poop time. Christ, man, we were just there. Super weird seeing, like, Digimon out in the wild that aren't palette swapped, like those Patamon there. If this was, like, Digimon World 1 instead of Patamon, it would be Tsukaimon. Oh, I can use full power. Oh, wow. Did it come down to half health in one hit? Oh, yeah, it did. Full power. Nothing. Oh no, did he just die of old age? Is that what happened? But we just got here. Oh, your partner reached the end of its lifespan. Your Digimon's core was transported here when it passed away. To continue your journey, it will need to be implanted in a new Digi-Egg. I didn't kill it. It died of natural causes. Don't fucking point fingers at me. The techniques your Digimon has mastered will be saved to your Digivice. Normally, when your partner collapsed, it would forget some techniques, but your Digivice will keep them safe and sound. Hmm, there's still some power left in this Digicore. I didn't overwork him. We had a fine day of training. Your new partner can inherit some of your former Digimon's power. It is also possible to register the core to your Digimemory as a summoning skill. 
Once you register a Digicord to your Digimemory, it can be used as a summoning skill that I don't know what that means. Do so press triangle during combat while the finish gauge is full. Then you can use a summoning skill instead of your partner's finishing technique. The stronger the bond between you and the Digimon you raise, the stronger the summoning skill will be. Summoning skills can only be used once per battle, and each Digimemory can only be used five times. However, there is said to be some way to reset a Digimemory's counter. If you have time, maybe you should look for it. So, will you register the data from this Digicore to your Digimemory? Yeah, man, that sounds cool. I don't know what that is. That's kind of like the, uh, those Digimemory things from the latest season of Digimon. That's kind of cool. Yeah, store it there. So, what does that mean exactly? Will it just, like, will that Greymon show up in battle? Ugumon's power was saved into the Digimemory. If you want to register it to your Digimemory, I'll have to do something. Yeah, transfer it. Transfer some of the power, I guess. Okay, choose which Digi-Eggs will inherit this power. Uh, okay, I'm gonna leave this one up to you guys. First person to pick a colored egg is going to be the one I choose. We got red, blue, yellow, purple, and green. Red was probably the Agumon I just had, so all right, purple was said good. I didn't want a red one. Purple it is. Are you sure you want the purple, did you, Egg? Yes, this one. There is no black one, Nalzi. All right, I'll transfer some of the power from your deceased partner into this Digi Egg. Oh, you know what? Since Ponty chews purple, we're gonna name him Ponty. That's what's going down. Alright, and that's that. Pontymon, right? Yeah. I'm like, whoops. I pressed X when I should have pressed circle. Well, I mean, when he digivolves to like a rookie and champion, I'll start calling him by that name, but that's fine enough. Got mail. Oh, he even makes the same little deal from Digimon World 1. It's really adorable. Overcome your sorrow. Glad you aren't feeling bad that your partner has gone back to being a baby, are you? In this world, that's normal. Besides, now you have the know-how you need to raise your partner. This time, your partner will probably mature more quickly and be stronger. If you train your Digimon well, it will evolve before reaching the end of its life. Digivolution extends your partner's lifespan. You should start by increasing your partner's abilities so they can be even stronger this time around. Use Digi Storage of Calcium to record. Oh, see, there's. That's what I want to do. I was trying to do a Gigimon's house earlier, but I can go to the Coliseum to do the partner's ability thing. It looks like a living blob of Seagamon, huh? Oh, Mega Seagamon sent me some now. I've ended up imposing on you twice now. Are you making good use of the skill I taught you? I noticed this after I got back home, but I found an unfamiliar accessory in my shirt pocket. In his shirt pocket. Okay. I don't have any use for it, so you take it instead. Take care now. Yeah, I'll take it. I, oh, I got, finally got a hat. Oh, I'm gonna put this fucking hat on. <laughs> Why would you screenshot that picture of Mega Seedron? It's a horrible face. Accessory, that's what I want. <laughs> Look, he's got a little hat. That's adorable. I don't have anything else. Look at that. Incredible. Yeah, that's super fucking kawaii. <laughs> Amazing. Look at him. He's a little semen blob with a hat. It's adorable. Oh, hoo -hoo -hoo. It makes a cute little wiggle. Let's go train. Let's throw him in front of that giant boxing glove. So yeah, no, no exploring. So if I get into a fight, it's gonna push my shit in. Look at that. He's tough enough to split that log. Oh, he's digivolving. 
doesn't take long for a guy this long. And he's gonna be, uh, in training. Oh, it's a Tokomon. No, first I'll praise him. No, not quite a Padamon. Padamon would be the next stage. Presumably. It could turn into a different rookie, I think, but... Padamon is what naturally follows this Tokomon. As you can tell by its appearance, it's a, essentially just a younger looking Patamon. Oh yeah, like Digimon can always turn into a turd. If you're just doing a bad job at raising it, it'll turn into a turd. You can get a Sukumon, which is that yellow crap looking one that usually has a Chumon riding on it. Or you can get a Numamon, which is a green slug. In Digimon World 1, the only thing they were good for was cleaning up shit. Because if your Digimon crapped out in the wild, the game would actually save where that crap was. Yeah, that's the one, Sukumon. Him and Numamon, if you pooped out in the wild, you could, like, they would eat it. You would approach the poop and they would clean it off the map. Otherwise, you'd have poop everywhere if you were a bad tamer. I mean, that game was super hard, so you could try as you might. Your Digimon will poop somewhere you don't want it to. But this is essentially Digimon World Easy mode, so uh, there's less chance of that happening. It hasn't happened yet, for sure. Well, I mean, there's actually... I guess there's kind of another use for uh, Numamon and Sukumon is... If you have a Digimon that sucks that bad, and you're like, there's no way I can fix this mistake, you can just, like, neglect him. Like, you can just, uh, like, let the days pass by and get food. And then just like save the food for uh, your next Digimon. Yeah, it's a, it's a pretty horrible thing, but you can do it. I really like that that Tokomon's like horrible looking mouth is like completely animated in 3D in this. Instead of just like a scary looking texture. They actually have all the little teeth in there, it looks really cool. See, Koromon went to Agumon, that's... Oh wait, no, I started with an Agumon, yeah, so... It could have become any of the, any of these. Well, I mean, if I had another Koromon, it could turn into any five. And Tokemon has a chance to turn into any five, and it doesn't give me any requirements, so maybe it won't even be a Patamon. Another thing that's kind of cool is uh oh, oh another Digimon. Let's see what I get. Is it gonna be a Patamon? Oh, it's a Biomon instead. Oh, already Digivolving the champion? Shit, yeah, man. Oh, and it's a Bergermon, too. It oh, looks so cool in this. Especially with that great hat. Oh, you thought I was going to that great ass? Do I need to turn the volume down on something so you guys can hear me correctly? Turning the game down a bit. Hi. It's a hat, by the way. Battles are so so much easier to avoid in this too. Like because of because uh all the backdrops and stuff in Digimon World, they were all like art and painted. You couldn't adjust the view like this. So and it was it was zoomed in way too close a lot of the time. So it was really hard to dodge Digimon, like, you'd be going somewhere and you'd hear their footsteps, but you don't know where the hell they are. And then boom, from the left side of the screen, right in your face, and now you're in a fight, and then you die. Uh, come on, it's a water type, I should probably just leave. I'm in a hurry, man. Now we're running. Oh, I'll just put me back to the start here. I think it's still too early in the in the morning though. Oh no, there's the one I can talk to. Oh, this is a sea anemone. You found it. Hey, don't bring it so close to me. It's gross. But I can't go back unless I take it with me. All right, give it to me. Ugh, so gross. Well, I'm going back to the city. Once I get back, it should be possible to sell new kinds of medicine at the hospital. See you later then. Yeah. Nice. Got me a fucking Impon. I'm trying to talk my girlfriend into cosplaying as Impon so we can go to Anime North together and be super adorable. 
Also, are these respawned? Spiky, I don't think I've had it. Oh, Jesus. 